Alright, what is up guys? Welcome back to another LSPDFR video. Today, we're going to be doing a little bit of Sheriff Patrol. We're going to be using this track hawk right here. So let's go ahead and take a look. Take a look at the lighting. I had to change the windows a little bit because they were too dark to see some of the lighting. But here we got stage one. Just a simple traffic advisor, nothing else. We got stage twos, adding some red and blues. Some flashing taillights, flashing headlights. And then all out stage three, just going crazy. We got some side markers, some rear markers, all that fun stuff. Let's go ahead and um, try to take a look inside the vehicle. Got a bunch of nice stuff going on inside the vehicle. We don't have a partition, but that's all right. We got some stuff in the trunk as well. All right, guys, let's go ahead and uh, let dispatch know we are available for calls. And then we'll go ahead and head out on patrol. Alright, looks like we got a stolen truck. So we're going to go ahead and head out that direction. Get a couple units to come with us, hopefully. Let's go. Looks like he might be coming. It looks like he's coming our direction on this little back road right here, and here he is. Dispatch, we got a visual on the perp. Let's make sure we got a couple units to help us out. Get a helicopter up, even though we shouldn't have to worry about that. Dispatch, Eagle to the location. Over. Oh! Okay. Yeah, I already know. We got the guy. I may have caught a couple too many units. Oh my gosh! Motorcycle, come on, man, really? You guys are just taking themselves out of my vehicle. So we'll see. He hasn't done anything crazy, so we can't try to pit or shoot out some tires or anything yet, but... We'll see what happens once he gets... Looks like he's going towards the highway, so we'll see what happens. He's moving kind of slow at the moment. So we should be all right. Oh, come on, man. If we do get this guy stopped when we do, we need to... We're going to want to go ahead and search the vehicle to see if he ditched anything inside the vehicle. As well as search him. See what he's got on him so we can go ahead and uh, go from there. But we got to get him stopped first. So let's go. Guess we're taking number three position now because these guys just kind of cut in front of me. <laughs> go around on this side don't want to get t-bones so we're gonna go ahead and do that make sure I have my gun ready so he pulls out jumps out of the vehicle and get him at a gunpoint Nice and easy, guys. And he just rammed the view. This might be it. Nope, this is not going to be it. Oh! Alright, let's get a tire out, because he did ram a vehicle. I already got two of them out. Oh, this might be it. Is he going to take off on foot? Get out of the vehicle with your hands up. Get out of the vehicle with your hands up. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Get your hands behind your back. What are you doing, man? Okay, I'm going to have to move this guy before we pat him down and stuff. This guy off to the side of the road. Let's go ahead and get a pat down on him. Apparently we're still grabbing onto him. <laughs> For whatever reason, we're still grabbing onto him. There we go. Nope. 
Oh, we're glitching out. <laughs> oh, there we go. We're patting him down, kind of. Alright, so he's got nothing crazy on him, but... Um, we are going to go ahead and run a ped check on him, see if he's wanted or any of that kind of stuff. And then we'll go ahead and um, slow down traffic. And he is wanted. He is wanted. There we go. Partially why he ran after he stole the vehicle. He is definitely wanted. Alright, let's go see if ditched anything inside the vehicle and get the vehicle towed away. And then we should be able to go ahead and get the vehicle towed away and then pull off to the side to do our arrest report. A silencer and a bunch of drugs. Nice. Since he was in possession of the vehicle, it is going to be, go ahead and be his possession. Come on, move out of the way. Hopefully it'll let me do... Just go ahead and hit my traffic advisors. Hopefully it'll let me go for him. No, it's not going to let me do it. So we're just going to have to go ahead and call him a transport. Get him transported to jail. And then we'll be able to move on. Let's go ahead and just wait for this guy to get picked up. Looks like our unit's right there. That guy's car is messed up. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and... If this guy hurries up and takes my prisoner, I'm going to go ahead and... If this guy wants to hurry up so I can go pull this guy over real quick, it'd be great. I'm going to just take this guy. Thank you. I'm going to go ahead and try to pull this vehicle over. As soon as he decides to move flat tire he's got smoking coming out of the front of his vehicle out of his engine compartment so we'll go ahead and uh, try to stop this guy got a couple people standing on the road over there what is this guy doing he's just not wanting to move okay I'm gonna go ahead and light him up he just not wanting to move. Doesn't help that this sheriff's officer is causing problems. Come on, dude. Move up somewhere and pull over. Come on. <laughs> Son of a bitch. You Okay, he's just gonna sit here, I guess. Now he's gonna move somewhere and almost hit a bunch of people. Is he trying to take off very slowly, or... What's going on here? I don't know what's going on here, but he's kinda just going nice and slow. Is he still... Is the traffic stop still active on him? I don't think the traffic stop is active on him anymore. I gotta get up and get it activated on him again. Yeah, it deactivated on him for some reason. Pull over to the right! Pull over to the right! Pull over to the right! Pull over to the right, dude. And stop your vehicle. Stop your vehicle right there. Stop right there. Stupid guy, come on. Alright, let's go ahead and get a plate check for the vehicle. Nope, there we go. He crashed. He's being dumb. Owner's license is suspended. Alright. Let's go ahead and uh, talk to the driver and see what's going on. Make sure the guy driving the vehicle is, in fact, this guy. Questioning menu. Do you know I pulled you over today, sir? We well, got a lot of vehicle damage. 
still driving, is it? That's not the point, sir. All right, let me get your license and registration, sir. And insurance. License up to date. Go, so the, this is not the registered owner of the vehicle. All right, sit tight for me, man. Oh, I gotta get my vehicle fixed. <laughs> Go ahead and write him a citation. Should be able to have it. Did I already pass it? I know it was on here. Where is it? Doesn't look like it's on here. I thought it was. Okay, we're just gonna have to go ahead and get him. I don't know. Is it correctable offenses? There it is. Vehicle unroadworthy. And yes, we are gonna be seizing the vehicle because it is pretty, pretty well damaged. Alright, so, so I'm going to be writing you a citation for the vehicle as well as we're going to be seizing the vehicle today since it is unroadworthy. You will come pick it up and uh, get it fixed. But for today, you're going to have to. Don't walk on the freeway. Sir! 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 Sir, stop! Sir! Get off the phone and stop! Let me, let me see your hands. Oh my god, this guy's gonna get killed out here. Ah, oh. Whatever, he's gonna get killed out here. <laughs> he does not want to stop for me, though. Need to back up. Sir, stop! Stop walking away from me. Sir! Stop walking away from me. You are not going to be walking on the freeway. Your passenger walked over into that shoulder and walked off that way. But you're not going to be walking on the, f on the highway. Sorry, but we're not doing that today, sir. I'm going to wait for that taxi to come pick you up and then we'll go from there. Taxi that's taken forever. That's literally on the wrong side of the road. Alright, when that taxi pulls up, go get in that taxi and get out of here, but do not walk on the highway. Wait. He's gonna get hit by a car. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Yep, yeah, there it is. There it is. Uh, he's fine. He just got right back up. He's fine. All right, there we go, guys. We're gonna be uh, gonna be back on the road. Back ten eight. Hey, we got a vehicle up here that is swerving all over the road right in front of this this blue bug right here. He is all over the road. So we're going to go ahead and make a stop on him. And have a chat with him. Maybe run some field sobriety tests because I believe he is intoxicated. But we'll have to see once we pull up to the vehicle and actually start speaking with him. Let's slow down traffic. No registration on the vehicle as well. I'm going to go ahead and approach from this side. Hello. How's it going today, sir? You know why I pulled you over today? 
Well, you're kind of driving recklessly and failing to maintain your lane. I don't know what you're talking about. All right. But you do know what I'm talking about. Unless you're intoxicated. Which I believe you to be Thanks. intoxicated. I'm probably going to be asking him to get out of the vehicle so we can run some field sobriety tests as well. Because I believe he is intoxicated. Go ahead and step out of the vehicle for me, sir. Yeah, you look intoxicated. Alright, follow me, sir. We're gonna be walking over here. So I don't want to be doing this in the middle of the street. Alright, we're gonna be running some field sobriety Hello. tests. We're gonna start out with the horizontal gaze test. So just go ahead and follow the pen with your eyes only, not your head. Just follow that pen, the tip of that pen with your eyes only, not your head. Alright, so you failed that one. I'm going to give you one more chance Hello. with the walk and turn. So I'm going to go ahead and ask you to take a couple steps this way. Turn around and walk back towards me. So go ahead and uh, I'll let you do that now. Let's go ahead and take like three or four steps. Turn around and walk back towards me. And he is highly, highly intoxicated. All right, sir. Uh, go ahead and place your hands behind your back. I'm arresting you for uh, DUI. Fail my sobriety test. You're swerving all over the road. You're gonna be going uh, going for a DUI. You got anything on you I need to know about, sir? All right, you got some heroin on you. That that's that's good. I think I already ran a pet check on this guy, but I'm gonna go ahead and run a pet check on him. Alright, you got no active warrants or anything, but you do have you are highly intoxicated right now and you're driving a motor vehicle. And that is against the law. Let's go ahead and uh have a seat in the back of my car right here, and then we'll go ahead and um Get your arrest report written up and get you on your way to jail. I don't know why you don't just go around, man. You could just go around. Okay, criminal traffic offenses, DUI, criminal possession, and yes, possession of heroin as well. Go ahead and create that arrest report. And then go ahead and get him a transport vehicle. Assistance needed in the And I'm actually gonna go ahead and search the vehicle. So I haven't yet. Hopefully he doesn't have a bunch of other stuff in there. And he's got some grenades. Nice. He's got grenades. I need to add some charges to that. Possession of an illegal weapon. Go ahead and add that as well. Because he has those grenades on him. And we're not going to worry about this car accident, but... We're going to be code for that. Attention unit one, Lincoln. Alright, got some known drug runners in a vehicle. Shores for possession of drugs for sale. So we're gonna go ahead and head over to this to the vehicle. I'm gonna go ahead and activate our lights because he is moving on the he is moving. This lady is gonna walk out right in front of us. Alright, he's going that way. Is he going to be coming down this way, or is he going to be going... Nope, he's right there. Heading the other direction. He is moving kind of fast. 
I'm going to activate my lights. Go ahead and pull up behind him. Attention unit one, Lincoln 18. Approach with caution. We got a Bugatti. If he runs, we're definitely going to need to call air support. There's no way I'm going to be keeping up with this guy if he decides to take off from me. Oh my gosh. I hate when you do that and they just fucking do that. Oh my gosh, he just launched himself. He just launched himself. Okay, let's retry that. I don't know what happened. Oi! What was that for, mate? Just stop right there, dude. I don't know what you're doing. Just stay right there. Don't be driving anywhere else. Possibly drug runners in a vehicle, so we don't want you to be running. We want to be careful when we pull up on him, too. Showing his no insurance on the vehicle as well. And he just took off. This is not going to be an easy pursuit. There are a lot of units in front of him that are not boxing him in. Yeah, but he's still on the move. I take point. See if I can get us get a pit going here. Pit unsuccessful. Got one of his tires out. This might be it. This might be it. Get out of the vehicle. Get your hands up. Get on the ground. Taser, taser, taser! Get on the ground with your hands up. Get your hands up. Get your hands up. Get your hands up and get on the ground. Where are you going today, sir? You ain't running from us. No, I didn't see any any sign of any drug stuff going on but he did flee from us so yeah he was found guilty of nothing except running from us dangerous driving and resisting arrest there you go no drug evidence because you know total of one year's result not not very good but oh well the evidence was probably in the vehicle or on his person but yeah there we go, guys. We're going to be code required. 4 that call and back 10 8. Up here. Possibly an officer under fire. Now oh, we just got two people standing in the middle of the road. Hey, what's going on today, guys? Get some code two backup. Go ahead and get my. I'm gonna go ahead and get my taser out as well. In case Locking things go south. Right. What's going on today, guys? Why are you standing in the middle of the road? I need you to move over. Well, not really the sidewalk, but just go over to the dirt. I'm not gonna shoot you. I'm not gonna shoot you. I might tase you. Okay, here we go. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Get your hands up. Get your hands up. Get on the ground. Why do you got blood on you? Why is that dirt or is that blood? Get on the ground. What are you doing trying to attack me like that? We're not playing that. 
You got anything illegal on you? Alright, I got some PCP. Alright, go ahead and, uh... Go ahead and escort him for me. I need to go to this next... I need to go to this call over here. Go to this traffic accident over here. Oh my, what is going on here? Suspect! Suspect is on foot! Dispatch, we got someone fleeing from the scene. He's attempting to steal it. He's stealing the vehicle. Copy, dispatch. Adam 4 en route. And not... I, Adam 4, copy. He's been shot. OS in pursuit of suspect in vehicle. Nah, he's been shot. He's been shot. Chill, chill, chill. He's been shot. Let's see if we can bring him back to life. Probably not. He's got a lot of blood come from his head. And we're going to have to get those two vehicles taken care of too, but... This guy actually just got his car jacked. I'm going to have to call the vehicle insurance for that. I am the law! What are you talking about? I'm not obstructing the law. I am the law. Alright, he has been alive. He is alive. CPR was successful. Oh my god, what is going on, Chew? What is going on with you guys? Oh my gosh. Alright, sir, but go ahead and put your hands behind your back. Fleeing the scene of an accident. And Grand Theft Auto. Got anything on you I need to know about? Dude, you need to chill, officer. Chill. Yeah, he's got a bunch of illegal stuff on him. Alright, dispatch, let me get a pet check. It's gonna be on a Marvin Zane, born 92494. Traitor. License is expired. We could get him on that too, but I'm not too worried about that because he's got a lot more stuff going on. Um with the Grand Theft Auto and fleeing the scene of an accident. Just want to go ahead and uh, take a seat in the back of my vehicle here. And we'll get you uh, we'll get you on your way. Okay, officer, since you don't know how to chill, I'll move my vehicle a little further out of the way. Since you don't know how to chill. And I cannot... Do an arrest report for him, which is, which sucks. But we'll just get a prisoner transport. Backup required in Sandy Shores. I'm gonna call it and just call the vehicle insurance for this guy. Backup required in so Insurance can come take Sandy that Shores. vehicle. Once this guy moves, I'll go ahead and reposition my vehicle and you take a look at this traffic stop or this traffic accident. As soon as this guy wants to get out of the way. Just take the prisoner and get out of my way. How are you? Oh my gosh, just move! Bro, move! Why are you being so dumb? Citizens report a petty theft on I'm not worried about that. I'm in the middle of some dispatch. As soon as this goes away, we'll go ahead and search the vehicle believe this is his vehicle let's go ahead and get a plate check to see if this is his vehicle or if this was the What's other the party's vehicle if this is his vehicle we'll go ahead and search it and see what we can find on it target license plate it's possibly coming back to the Boy, other person Queen, nine, so we're not going to be searching that vehicle required in unless Sandy we can prove that he was driving that vehicle oh my gosh chill officer chill why are you guys always running into me? Alright, let's go ahead and wait for this guy to take this vehicle, and then we'll be, uh, code for it. Just call him back. 10-8. Alright, guys. That's gonna go ahead and do it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed, and we'll see you all in the next one. Peace!